Hello and welcome back to Still Little Debbie. And this is episode six of my Alpha 17 season seven Let's Play. <laughs> um, we had a good run last time. Got our forge going. I, I took all the, the stuff out of it. I checked my iron shovel up last night <laughs> doing some digging you want to repair it not scrap it <laughs> yeah that would be i would cry if i did that but you know what ifs let's see let's put some of this stuff away Yes. Um. All right. One of the things I want to get going real quick is to get some nails so we can upgrade our storage. Ooh. Um. Yeah, I think that's what I want to make. 120. craft 12 storage boxes um let's see i did a little bit more digging down here i didn't get much much more done uh i dug out over here i'm gonna like do this section first most of it's snow but the bottom two layers is dirt and that is precious <laughs> Let me tell you. All right. Um, I have just been chopping away like a mad lady at the trees, trying to get as much as I can. Let's go ahead and get these storage crates made up. Get them going. Yeah, I can start organizing stuff. Um, I'm really nervous. I don't have any metal. I'm thinking I might take some of this. How much can we make? 116. That's all. I don't have a lot. I need more metal. I need like for a barbed wire fence and such. Oh, I don't have enough wood. Oh my goodness. Our trees are growing. Look, I think they're at the 900 stage now. I'm gonna try my best to get, let them uh, mature. I need to come over here. And the, there's a couple of trees that I couldn't plant over here because these were in the way. There we go. And I and for some you can't pick a sapling back up once you placed it. It's like no longer technically there. So it's it's like impossible. You can't drop anything on it to break it like the grass. So I tried that. <laughs> But I couldn't place these saplings down over here because those hadn't grown up yet. So yeah, I'll probably go ahead and uh, I need to get rid of this rock. <laughs> it's a bit of a problem. But that'll give us tons of stone. So uh, I'm trying to fill this out so I know I can put some ramps up so that they won't just rip through the middle of it. But I'm you know, I think the damage is going to be very minimal because they'll just like make one hole and then go through. So it'd be like two frames that would break, possibly four to get through the other side. Um, I'm just hoping I solidified the 
the block underneath the dirt, hoping that they wouldn't break the one underneath the dirt. And I need to do that on this other side too. So, the, uh, well, <laughs> some of these don't have a block underneath it. So, there we go. Because if they break that block, my dirt goes kaput. And that one's on ground. There we go. I would really, really love to like just go out and loot and loot and loot some more, but man, it's day six and I don't have near as much on the base done as I would like. Seriously. Uh, so I think um, maybe we'll have like some light looting and then we'll come and <laughs> chop down more trees or something because with all of this uh, terrain being uneven it's throwing me out of whack. <laughs> And I'm hoping, I'm put, trying to put ramps up where I can so that they'll have a, a pathway up. Even though, you know, these aren't going to be like permanent because I'm going to add on to it. So I'm, I'm not going to solidify these ramps. They're going to get tore down, well picked up, and then replaced on the outer edge. And I think... Um, on the outer part, I might, instead of having such a steep incline, because this feels, um, when you go up it, oh, you're like, uh, uh, <laughs> you can't go up near as fast. So I thought about making a little bit longer so it's not as steep and we could use the wedge and the wedge tip to make it uh, a much more gradual slope. But that's, uh, not gonna be done right now. Oh, it looks like he might have destroyed one of my blocks. What a punk. Actually, it looks like a couple of them got destroyed. Or never got put up. Because that should be here. Yeah, I wonder what the heck that came from. Let me make sure that's in the right spot. One, two, three, four. I should be there. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> so yeah, I was uh, measuring out this other side. I want to at least get it to where I have the hallways out so they can come up. Uh, but I need to get these solidified and I need to put barbed wire fence on them. Uh, that's like the whole plan is for them to come down this hallway and then they get stuck on the barbed wire. It slows them down and then I can shoot at them a lot easier. Do I have food? I don't have food on me. What the heck am I doing? But I need to like make sure these don't get destroyed. Oh no, see, this is why I need the wood. I need the wood badly. Alright, did I have more food? Please tell me I had more food. Awesome. That's like all the food I have. That's not good. Um, yeah, we might have to, let's go ahead and save that. Actually. Oh man, I need some food.
Yeah, I would love to go loot, but I, I need to chop more wood. <laughs> Look, there are trees that are uh, not saplings. There's something wrong with that. Um, I think what we might do is real quick, just so we could get a little bit of looting in. Actually, oh, I, need to, I need to get those boxes made and at least put them down so that, you know, overnight I can organize things and get them just to where I like it. And I ran off without my food. Oh, I'm so excited to get get going and to do stuff. <laughs> I'm screwing around. How many can I make all four of them? Yes. Alright, so let's go back up. Place down all our loot crates. I mean storage crates because I haven't looted them yet. <laughs> uh, grab the food that I ran off and left. There we go. Maybe a little bit more water. We don't really need that much water, I don't think. Awesome. Okay, so I'm going to do the... You know, pretty much put these in the corners. For our various loots. Awesome. Okay, so we got those down. Um, let's just put these ramps and stuff there and we'll go, yeah, we'll put these up here. I haven't used that yet. Um, <laughs> I mean, I still have like this iron pickaxe too. Um, I just, I'm not ready to do mining just yet, so I haven't really... Um, thought about it. I'm mainly just chopping down trees. So let's see. What We want to go over there to this little um, cave. <laughs> the little well. It's, uh, it's not that big of a, a thing. It's got a couple of crates in it. It'll be good for us to uh, get, get a little bit of loot. And then we can come back and continue on the tree chopping venture and look at that. Let's go ahead and eat a couple and drink a water. Okay, yeah, we're good on water now for a while. Uh, but at the, like the first episode, I snuck in and grabbed this crate. Uh, let's go ahead and grab that cement too, why not? awesome but if you notice there's like um there's a well here if you go down oh let me get down eh i'm gonna shut that so nothing comes on top of us uh-oh we already woke something up come on we can like put this little ledge down here <laughs> Did I wake anything up? I think there might be. S I heard something, and there's usually like a couple zombies over here. Yeah, I think he's under the water. Oh, there he is. Oop. Back home. Sit down. Uh oh. Alright. I changed my mind. Oh, batter up. <laughs> I love watching those guys go go flying. Okay, we're gonna try and get that guy all the way up against the wall over there. Oh, <laughs> and there's a big mama sitting right there. We're just going to go up and we're going to see if we can smack her down with this. 
Oh, she just took it and went, what? Is there a fly busting around my face or something? <laughs> uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Give me my arrow back. And yeah, they got some good shamway crates, like popping pills, and uh, some ammo bag, weapon bag, and duffel bag. Oh. I'm not sure if we have shorts. I think we might actually have them, but we'll keep them just in case. Because there's not a whole heck of a lot down here to loot. Um, what I do want to get, though, as well, is I want to go over to this little cave in the back of the cave, across the water, and uh, get the aloe and stuff. Because <laughs> I don't get a loot a whole lot when we go to the desert, uh, because I'm trying not to pick things up. So I have room for the loot. Got a couple of... Those will be good once we get the recipe to make the sham chowder. Okay, so not such a good thing. We're going to see if we can hit Big Mama over there. Oh, yeah. Oh, she's going to... She's gonna swim over to us. I wonder, can I shoot her underwater? We gotta go quite a ways out here. <laughs> oh, that was great. Now, did we kill her or is she still alive? <laughs> okay, I think she's dead. Sweet. Yeah, she's dead. Let's get our arrows. See, there's a hole. If you step on those boards, you fall. You probably take a lot of damage and land up here so that wouldn't be good plus there's mushrooms we need the mushrooms too um this could be a, like a good source of gravel as well sand and stone uh later on it's closer than like um the desert so I mean if you look even I think everything under here is gravel under the water but like this whole pathway down here is just checked plump full of gravel all of this it's all gravel And that's it. That's it. <coughs> it's not like a huge thing. But if it's a little bit, right? Um, I think what we might do is uh, chop down this tree. It's really bushy looking. I don't think it's growing either. chopped down so many trees I swear <laughs> I have been a tree chopping fool holy schmoly look this is a good one it's gonna be like 1200 so let's get this one yes um what's good is that 
this tree will net us about a couple hundred wood. It's not bad. Um, especially since you can just sit here and hold down uh, left click on the mouse and get it done. There we go. It wasn't quite 200. It was 181. But once we get our levels up, it will, you know, go to over um, 200 every time. And then once we get our farm going, if you think about that, that's uh, 12 trees on that we're going to have on each side. That's going to be, if you get 200 for each, that's 2400 wood a side. That's a lot of wood every time you clear it, but it takes a while for those trees to grow. It's not like every day that you can clear it. Like it takes a couple of days for the trees to mature all the way up to 1200. Uh, so, yeah, but <laughs> what's bad is that I could go through that much wood in one day. I seriously could. <laughs> It says, oh man, I've been using so much wood, making hundreds and hundreds of frames, and uh, I still need to get, like, spikes, which I, I, I'm not so much concerned about the spikes as I am the barbed wire, so, because I have, like, zero metal at all, just, just, <laughs> This is all I got. That's all I have. And it's uh it's freaking me out because I need I need the metals. I need them. And we only have enough for like a hundred or so in the forge, so I don't know what to do. So how much wood do we, we got a couple hundred now, 400, that's good, that's good. Um, I'm going to go ahead and scrap this, it only sells for nine, but we'll get three mechanical parts, and I'm pretty sure it kicks the ammo out too, yeah, we just got extra 15 ammo. That's good that it does that because I would be the one that would forget. <laughs> Let's go ahead and finish this off. Yeah, I need to get all of this stuff in here solidified. I want like the whole ring around uh, the cage in the middle to have um, barbed wire barbed wire along these hallways in it. Uh, I don't know. I might not even do the uh, the spike traps. Or I'll do them at first. It's because I don't have any freaking metal right now. Um, so I'll do that at first. Uh, with the traps. Because I'm, I, I know where to get the wood. I've got tons and tons of wood. Not so much metal. So this is going to be... This is like what I do at night. <laughs> As I just... I chop wood and I come over and I place frames and I upgrade them. I moved too soon, dang it. But I've been doing a lot, a lot of placing and not upgrading. But I've, uh, I have to make like three times as many frames now to go out because that, uh, that drop is now three blocks lower. So, oh. awesome. Okay. I've got so much to do, I don't even know where to start. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Um, I like that I can use these uh, fence with that 
and I put them on the outside of this too. Uh, saves a little bit on the cost of doing it and I've once I get the hallways put up let's see get my favorites going here so like the hallways are gonna come out on all sides And they're going to be as tall as that. I like it being six tall because the zombies uh, can't just reach up and break your floor out. Like, they're going to have to have piles of dead bodies, <laughs> you know, and uh, jump up or whatever to, to break your floor down. And... I don't know. That's one of the drawbacks. One of the reasons why I don't like taking over a POI is because uh, it, it doesn't take that into consideration. <laughs> you know what I mean? I guess I didn't have to go all the way out. We just want to go 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And that's where our always going to be. I'd like to at least get, oops, that goes up to just one. I'd like to just get uh, the hallways solidified all the way around the base for the first horde at least. But I don't know that I'm going to be able to do that. Um, so I might take take this part back. And this part and then just uh go across. <laughs> And sort of make that area. Oops. Yeah, this area. Where they're going to be coming into the base. So where they can actually, you know, get in there easily. Make sure they have ramps so they don't have to jump up or anything. don't really know how this is going to work. Uh, get my little markers here. Uh, that's where my, I'm going to put more pillars. And it's going to come out. But luckily this side is only... Oh no! You stupid snowberry plant! You wrecked my frame. Uh, now, uh, it's going to be murder trying to get all these things upgraded, but my concern is just making everything level right now. I don't, I mean, if they destroy a couple of frames, so be it. It'll be okay, because it's only like four wood, but I think they're going to be drawn more towards the center and do more damage there. All right, so let's get these markers out. All right. And then we got to do this side, but I'm going to oh, I'm going to need way more wood. Ooh, oh, flop <laughs> Oh man, so let's go put some of this uh, stuff away. Alright, here's our food chest. I'm going to put all this stuff in there. We don't need the oak seed in there. I 
I guess we could eat these because we're we're really low on food and they don't get made into anything. Hopefully we don't get food poisoning. Oh, phew. Food poisoning sucks. Let's see, we probably need some water too. Not really, but we drank it anyway. Um, yeah, we already have shorts. So we can scrap this. Alright. Feathers. Metal. Coal. Cement. We don't have that much cement. I'm not really... I, for... I totally forgot the ammo. There we go. We got 1,300. Ooh. <laughs> Let's take, um, yeah, take some of this. And we'll make up some cobblestone rocks while we're out chopping down some more trees. That's what, um, that's what that room is for now. It's not really for stuff. Uh, <laughs> I probably won't ever store anything. It's just um, it's just there to. Oh, we need we need the actual wood first. Look at all that forest of stuff out there. I think I'm going to go this way because I haven't really gone that way before. I've been going towards the other side. But these are going to be more mature trees because I didn't plant them. So they were, you know, part of the world gen. So they're going to be like 900 and 1200 wood. So it'll, it'll give us more. And that's okay. Oh man, I can't, I need metal, where am I going to get all the metal? We might have to, um, uh, maybe take a wrench and go loot it. Well, look at that, a backpack, oh, it's already been looted, I'm a, I've already been over here. <laughs> no, oh, I didn't, yeah, I did replant. But I only put one down. Oh man, I wish I would have gotten a an axe. I think. I think he might have a fire axe, but I hate to waste the time to go over there if he doesn't. And what if I don't have enough money to buy it? And I'll have wasted all that time that I could have been chopping trees, checking at the merchant. <laughs> so, ah. give me that stone. Did I not place it? I guess not. So yes, these these trees will get us a lot more wood, but it will take longer to chop them down. I can't wait until. Um, I get into the iron tools. Um, I think I did, I am making levels overnight, chopping trees and placing blocks and upgrading them. It's not a huge, huge amount of experience, but it is at least moving forward. <laughs> it's better than nothing, right? I mean, I'll still get more if I go... Uh, kill zombies and stuff. Um, we we'll definitely once we get twenty, um, we can then make our own iron tools. I haven't found um, I haven't found a hoe. 
So once we get a hoe and we get access to that, we can start farming and our food situation will mellow out there and we'll be able to not have to worry about, oh my god, I gotta kill these animals or I'm gonna die. <laughs> uh, let's go, oh, I gotta harvest these crops or I, I might, you know, have to scrounge up and go kill animals. <laughs> But once you get points into um, the living on the land, living off the land, oh man, you get start doubling and tripling your crop yield. You just start rolling in, rolling in food. You just like throw your food on the <laughs> ground, roll around on it. It's like ah, you take a bath in it and stuff. <laughs> it's kind of disgusting to eat it afterwards, but... Meh. Oh, 700 wood. It's hard to believe, but oh, like, I had 700 wood and I'm like, oh, that doesn't last me like two seconds. Because like 50, 50 wooden frames. Let's cue that up and I'll show you how much that takes takes a hundred wood and I go like this boom there's 200 wood gone <laughs> and that lasts me like five minutes <laughs> so it takes me longer to chop down the tree than it does to actually use up all of those frames it's crazy that's why um, for me I need that wood that tree farm I need it uh, it'll be even better once uh, I get all four sides up, that way it'll kind of like be on a rotation, you know, and uh, I can like clear, um, clear one side every day, you know, and, and pretty much have a couple thousand wood on me every day, and that's the plan. Never want to be shorted on the wood. Is that a, that's another one of those little POIs. What? Um, so there's like two of them? There's, yeah, there, that's what it looks like and that's what it looks like. So there's two. Let, well, we got time. Let's go do this one. It'll be a little bit of loot because I know we've been chopping down trees. We need like a little, a little bit of a break. Uh, <laughs> a little bit of a break to make all of this work worthwhile. We gotta have some fun, right? We can get a crate right up here. Oh, yes. This is awesome. And let's get our shovel ready because we'll grab that concrete too. Oh, an engine! What? Uh huh. I love getting the engines. We're not like to the point where we're, we're getting those yet, so that is awesome. Okay. Let's see if we can get down here. Ah! Oh, he's waiting. Hello. A doink. A doink. A doink. I said, stay down. Oh yeah, look at that. We got two <laughs> skill points to spend. I think we woke somebody up getting down here. Yep. Oh, right in the eyeball. I swear I didn't mean to do it. It was an accident. I, I flinched. I flinched at the last second. And, and oh my goodness, look at that. <laughs> 
Ah, oh, good times, good times. Oh, hello, Farmer Jack. Was that your wife? Oh, sorry about that. You gotta have fun. You gotta have fun. Oh, Mr. Skater Punk. Bada bing, bada boom. And that's all she wrote. Oh, he's so theatrical. Ah, I die. Eh. All right. Um, yeah, we'll just break it with this. Oh no. Okay, 14 isn't worth it. I need to get like a, another mod, another hammer, so I can get a little bit more damage. Just need a little bit. Just so it will go in two hits, because it's got like one hit point left. <laughs> it seems like a waste to use the hammer for one point of damage. Awesome, okay. So, I see one guy over there. I wonder, can we make it all the way over there? Oh, oh yeah. Now, if you go on the outskirts over here, you can actually walk without swimming. But he's not that smart. Oh, bud, that looks like it hurts. Oh, I missed. Here, come up here. Oh! Oh, here's another guy. Oh! <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just so funny. Being a fly through the air like that is just awesome. I love it. I mean, it, it's worth it to me to have the hammer just for that. <laughs> Even if I take a couple of hits now and then, it's worth it to see them fly through the air like that. Like, whack! <laughs> oh, good times, good times. Oh, look, my arrow's on the water. There we go. So that was, uh, that was all right. We got, um, not really a whole lot of anything. We, we did get some more mushrooms and stuff, so that'll help our farms once we get to that point. And we got a cool engine. So that's good. And uh, we got a buddy waiting for us up here. Hello. Oh, two of them. Chin and chin. Oh, <laughs> that looks like it hurt. Yeah, we're just gonna pick up some rocks while we get our stamina back. Oh, snickerdoodles. That, that smarted. Wham! Yes. All right. So we'll like um. Leave a little sign to ourselves that we've been here. Oh, look at that. There's some dinner. I'm gonna chop this tree down. Oh, yeah. Let's get our bone shiv. I can't wait to get iron tools and we can actually have a dagger, a knife, a hunting knife. That would be awesome. All right. Um, yeah, we're gonna say that we've been here by chopping these trees down because they obviously don't go in this biome. That way we'll know if we come across this again. Oh, this is fun to bend with this stuff. Move the trees away. Did you ever notice that 
you know, when, you know, some people refer to themselves as we, I, th I thought that was strange until I started uh, taking uh, German in college and the teacher explained to me that that is actually a, a German thing um, <laughs> where, where I guess, you know, Germans do it too. I'm sure other people do it, but they, they named it. It's called the Royal We. And usually, you know, the royalty would use it and they would refer to them and their followers as we. Uh, so, yes. <laughs> you are my followers. We shall see about that. Okay, so now we gotta get to more chopping. I'm gonna put my tools up there so I don't accidentally throw it away. We're gonna scrap this pistol again. We don't need the tier one and they really don't sell that well. We get the bullets and three mechanical parts, so I'm good with that. Awesome. So, oh, that was a bunny rabbit. I thought, man, that is a very small screamer. <laughs> Oh boy. Okay, okay. Did, got absolutely nothing accomplished today. We got uh, 800 wood and got a little tiny bit of loot. Um, I guess we're gonna call the episode. I'm gonna like try to fill out at least the hallways, 10 out around each side and then get ramps up to them like this. Uh, Basically like this side. It doesn't have the trees on it, but it does have the part for the hallways. So this is what I'm hoping to have accomplished by in the morning. <laughs> uh, now this side, I'm probably just gonna fill in and then on the sides put the ramps because it, it actually has the, the tree farm. So I'd put like ramps along here so they can come up and then over and just fill all this in and this one's um already ready just need to get some ramps just get some ramps going and i'm hoping i'm i'm kind of hoping they don't come from one of these sides that they come from the others so that they don't wreck my tree farms just yet uh but like i said i don't think they're gonna do a ton of damage because once they break in through the rest will just follow that path so I'm hoping anyway I really really am <laughs> oh man it just seems like I, I never can get enough done on my base uh, it, it's always growing always expanding we need more cobblestone to, to actually make the hallways just so we can because uh, I want to put like um, put the hallways down here and then they'll come up the walls will come up here and here and then I want to put some more uh, wooden bars along there so as they're coming down of the hallway I can still walk over and shoot them um, because the plan is to fill like these inner hallways up with barbed wire and then fill that one up so they're like slowed down the whole time they're over here um, and that's like uh, the only way they can get into the base to do real damage so that's the plan anyway <laughs> and the plan is for me to just shoot them, me to do all the damage so that I get experience. Uh, and I don't play like doing anything crazy like having 32 zombies, you know, at once. So it's just only eight zombies at a time. So I should be able to uh, do that. Hopefully we'll see how it goes. Maybe we'll bump it up to 12 or something and see how that goes. But I don't know. For right now, I don't know if I'm even going to have a base <laughs> after the first port. 
so we're gonna go ahead and call it here I'm gonna chop down a whole bunch more trees and hopefully get some more work done anyway thank you for watching and we'll see you next time bye bye